Y'all know what time it is, so let's get it. He's really good at playing the dick, eh? I kept asking myself, why would Wells pretend to need a wheelchair? Sympathy, I suppose. That's what I thought at first, but he's the man in yellow. He's the reverse flash. He's much smarter than that. Sympathy can't be the only reason. Yeah, it was a misdirect. Just like everything else Wells has done. I mean, the last person we'd suspect to be the man in yellow is someone who lost the use of their legs. That's exactly right, Joe. Which is why I started messing around with the wheelchair. And that's when I found this. Interesting. Avengers. You know how uh, 
superhero moves and stuff. Remember when Banner grabbed the staff? Nick Fury put his hand on his gun. It's like, what is your gun going to do to him? Nothing. Your gun ain't going to do shit. Someone please make a movie where cop don't grab his gun against a supervillain. But he's just like, this ain't gonna do nothing. Come on, Barry. Oh, shit. He ain't got his chair no more. Maybe Barry can catch him. Fuck. Damn. Still can't catch him. Fuck. Well, Barry, maybe you need to sit in that motherfucking chair. You marry Barry, bitch. Don't touch me. Play! Jeez. I hate this remote. I hate this remote! I think you all know that. It'll be an ongoing joke. Jeez. Play. Uh huh. Come on. Under that hatch in the pipeline. I'm so sorry. I, 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 th I thought I looked. 
thought they were for you. It's not your fault. Sometimes you just can't see the clues, even if they're right in front of you. Oh, shit. Um, well, you know, all that's important is that we're all safe and back together, right? Betty, why did he take you? I don't know. He said that we're family. He said his real name is Eobard Thorn. Eobard Thorn. This is like in my dream. Did he say anything else? I mean, anything that could help us figure out what he's really after? I just, he didn't say much. He just kept working on some tube. A tube? What did it look like? Metallic. Of futuristic. He said it was the key to him getting back everything that was taken from him. Kia, yeah, I don't understand. What... Yeah, I don't know. Look, I just want to go home. Is that okay? Yes, of course. I'll make sure you get some rest. But how does he know that? Why would Wells want the particle accelerator to work again? I don't know. It's not like it was such a big success the first time. It made me the flash. And it's not all it did. So what yeah. happens if the particle accelerator turns on while the metahumans are in their containment cells? They're toast. We put them down there, and now their lives are in danger because of us. Look, I think you all know I've never been a fan of this arrangement here. I thought the whole plan was to rehabilitate them and set them free. It was. We've been a little busy. Well, if they stay in there, they die. And if we let them go, they destroy the city. We're gonna have to move them. Move them where? Iron Heights can't handle metahumans. You're right. But Lian Yu can. What the hell's a Lian Yu? Lian Yu is the island where Oliver was stranded for five years. Argus built a covert military prison on it. That's where we sent Captain Boomerang. Right. Uh, Oliver keeps his worst criminals there. They won't be able to escape, and more importantly, they won't be able to hurt anybody. Great. So we ship them from one illegal black site to another. Yeah, That's right. I, I guess so, yes. Then how do we move them to Oliver's own private Alcatraz? I'll call them. Maybe he can help with transport. And Cisco, if we do this, nobody can get loose. We might have a way of getting them out of here safely. All right, get on it. Can we have to do this? You don't think that if we start busting super villains through downtown, nobody's gonna notice? Oh, they'll notice. That's where you'll come in. Cecile. Oh, that's my favorite DA. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, anything for my favorite detective. Say the least. I can't, I can't keep 
Let me talk to her for a minute. Yeah, Joe. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, nothing to say, Malcolm. Give me another one. Ice cold. Fucking campy ass villain lines. Well, well, well. If it isn't the Scarlet Speedster, we need to talk. Play, jeez, man. You want anything? Beer, food, pickled eggs here are fantastic. No, I'm good. I need your help with a problem. Must be pretty desperate to come asking for my assistance, yeah, right. but I'll bite. What do you need? Help transporting some people out of the city. How many? Five. Cold as ice. Very bad. It's very extra. Angry people who have powers. Powers. Hmm? So you want me to what? Freeze the problem? Protect you from them if anything goes wrong? First rule of business: always protect yourself. I'm not going to help usher your enemies out of town. Hey, they're not just my enemies; they're your enemies too. I doubt it. They will destroy Central City. It's not my problem. You said that you love it here, that this is your home. I do, and it is. Well, guess what? These people get loose, there won't be a city to love anymore. We won't be able to rob anyone if everybody's dead. <laughs> it's a compelling argument. So if I'm going to help you out, I'll need something in return. Like what? This. <laughs> no, well, I mean, th this is impossible. I can't do that. No, no, I can't help you. There has to be. Sorry, there has to be something you want that I can get. Let me think about it. What do they ask for? I was checking her out, so I was like, who that walking over? <laughs> here. You were kidnapped for nearly two weeks, and your first thought is to go back to work? I just needed something constant in my life. I thought that was us. Hey, I miss you. Keep dropping. I love you. Hey. I saw this when we found you. This was for me, wasn't it? When you took me to the waterfront, and Dr. Wells abducted you, you were going to propose. I was. Now you're not. What did he do to you? He didn't do anything to me, Iris. That's what he showed me. What could he possibly have shown you that would make you change your mind about us? The future. He showed me the future, Iris. 
years. We don't get married. You and Barry do. Look, I gotta go. He told her. Are you out of your mind? What do you mean you talk to Leonard Snart? I have to go. Why would you do something so stupid? Because, Joe, we have already tried everyone else. Look, you tried the CCPD. I tried Oliver. I even tried Ronnie and Dr. Stein. And the particle accelerator goes online in 16 hours. 16 hours, Joe. I'm not willing to let the metas die. And we can't let them escape either. So, like it or not, Snart, with his cold gun, is the only one that can stop them if Cisco's transportation does not hold. And lucky for you, I figured out what it is you can get me. Hello, Detective. Nice to see you again. Get my gun again. Cisco, I thought about your proposal. You want my help? This is what I want. My fingerprints, dental records, DNA, criminal records, family tree, everything there is in this world concerning Leonard Snart. I want it destroyed. All of it. At CCPD, online, everywhere. The brass on this dude. You really think we'd do that for you? I'll do it. If it's the only way, fine. You and me need to talk right now. <laughs> Joe's drawing a line. What is wrong with you? You can't just erase Snark's criminal records. Yeah, I can. And I'll do whatever I have to do. There, there's got to be a different way to do this. Okay, but well, what is it, Joe? Tell me what it is, and we'll do it. We're running out of time. What is going on with you? You working with that killer? This isn't who you are. Who I am is the guy who's not fast enough to stop Wells. He, he hasn't been one step ahead of us, Joe. He's been a thousand. I can't catch him. I can't beat him. What I can do is save those people down there. Wells turned them into what they are, and I'm pretty sure he does not care if they live or die. I do. CCPD, Argus, and the FBI had on you and sent a virus to erase every digital record of you online. And this is every single piece of physical evidence the police had. Good. I fear we're all going to be working together. That's right, sis. That's right, sis. Partners. Play. Play. Don't fall for it.
you get the Mad Humans to the airport? I have, actually. And it's pretty dope. This is cool. Where'd you get this? My uncle owns it. His company hauls frozen food cross-country. Okay, so I retrofitted the cooling system with the wheelchair's power source to create an energy damper. Of course you did. Which means what, exactly? Basically, the back of this rig is being flooded with so much power that it's effectively creating a transient pulse strong enough to disrupt the metahuman's powers. So we can get him to the airport and get him on the plane without him getting fresh on us. Technically, we need somebody with a Class A commercial driver's license to drive this, though. I can drive it. What? With a Class A CDL. You do? We can't all be doctors. All right, well, let's do this. Plane's going to be here in two hours. And, and, and got Optimus Prime. <laughs> Go ahead, Optimus. That's what I'm talking about. I'm helping the Flash. Autobots transform and roll out. <laughs> hey, we Let's just hope Wells isn't working with Megatron. <laughs> True. True. <laughs> you just want to fight to fight. I'm falling for that shit.
they double cross them. I was like, he did something to her. I remember him. Why don't I remember the guy with the eye beam? Something tells me they'll be a lot more used to me as part of my rogues than rotting away in the North China Sea. <laughs> it's true, I did, but here's the thing. I'm a criminal and a liar, and I hurt people, and I rob them. What did you expect me to do, not be what I am? I saw an opportunity to turn things to my advantage, and I did. Who you're really mad at is yourself. This is on you. See, that's why you ain't supposed to fall for that dumb shit. I don't like this episode. That's stupid.
that's not the kind of hero you are. What the hell am I? The kind that cares about whether or not those criminals lived or died. I mean, whatever Martin and Nimbus and Shona did, they were human beings. And you knew letting Wells use them as pawns was wrong. You know the difference between right and wrong. And you weren't willing to blur the lines between the two. That's the kind of man you are. And that's what makes you different than the hero. So, please. No more walks on the dark side. Agreed? Yeah. What the hell is that? Guys, the particle accelerator is fully charged and online. Whatever Wells needs it for, it's ready. relationship because some lunatic from the future told you that I am destined to marry Barry? Well, I don't believe that, okay? I believe that we choose our own destiny. I decide who I love, and I love you. Whatever future Wells showed you is not my future. It's not our future. Please, let me prove it. This isn't about the future, Iris. It's about here, now. Today, ever since the very beginning, there's been three people in this relationship. Hmm. You, me, and Barry. That's not true. You can deny it all you want. But Barry knows it. Joe knows it. And if I'm going to be completely honest with myself... I know I knew. I knew. I always knew. I guess I just thought I could love you enough to change things. Sorry. But if you really do love me, you'll make this end. Fine. And then it ends. Well, that's all clear. Her and Barry. Go. Well, I heard your prison transfer didn't go so well. I'm so sorry. All a part of your plan, I assume? Actually, that didn't factor into my plan at all. But I'm impressed. He went to such great lengths to keep those people from harm. Ever the hero, huh, Barry? You've heard enough people. I know. You see me as the villain, but Barry, if you would have looked back. Just learn the hard way not to trust the bad guy. And yet, I've shown you time and time again. You can't beat me, Barry. Wow. You brought yourself a friend. <laughs> Say, yeah. this, this is gonna be fun. Oh, I see. I was like, is it suit in the ring? Wow. 
Was that it? <laughs> Okay, okay, so so they're getting it. Hold on. I didn't know this was gonna be a, a fight like this at the end. I'm glad this shit picked the fuck up! Shit, I was bored. Play. Alright. <laughs> Move like you can see. Oh shit, I did disable him. I'll be damned. <laughs> cool. Good guy again. I kill his monkey ass. Fuck all the extra good guy shit. What you gonna do with him? talking about you get to save mom all right y'all post your comments down below let me know what you think if you enjoyed my reaction hit the like button subscribe and share if you did not i'm gonna oh, choke your heart out like wells one million subscribers Woo!